a math lesson with Elle McPherson and Terrence Howard. Elle's first Welco brand New York City store opened last week. It's on the corner of Broom and Crosby. I'm going to go check it out. I'm very excited about it. Terrence Howard has Empire on Fox. And Sorry You Blues, I Feel Bad is on NBC at 9.30 after Ray and Grace. Let's go back to the phones. Patty from Wisconsin. Patty, what's your question? Hi, my question's for Al McPherson. Okay. Uh, I, I was wondering, on a scale from 0 to 10, how would you rate Matt LeBlanc as a kisser on Friends? Oh, he's a 15. He's a 15. He's a 15. I love him. <laughs> wow. Wow. Uh, let's go to Alexa from New York. Hey, Alexa. Hi, Alexa knows my how car. are you? I know. <laughs> Great. How are you? Good. Um, my question is for Terrence. Okay. Um, so how did you react to Taraji P. Henson's engagement? And, like, how did she tell you the news? But also, can you give us some clues on the possible wedding date? I have no idea when the wedding date is. But I tell you, after spending probably hundreds of lifetimes with Taraji, and you know that when you bump into your friend that you've met before, I think I've never seen her happier. That's nice. I love you. Let's go to Cindy from Indiana. She has a question for L. McPherson. Hi, Andy. I sure do. L, what is your relationship like with Kelly Simone today? And did you ever watch her when she was on the New York Housewives? Oh, the, she's asking about this. Oh, the, the, because the Real Housewives of New York was on Bravo, which is this channel. Right. Kelly's Kelly. husband was. Mary Kelly's ex-husband was my first husband yes. that I married when I was like a kid. Yes. Um, and I'm still really good friends with actually. Nice. And Kelly, she's she's good. I mean, yeah. she's she's raising the girls and doing her thing. Did you ever see her on the Real Housewives of New York when it's she was on? Not my. It's not your. It's oeuvre. not my thing. It's not no, your oeuvre. but that doesn't mean that it's yes. not good. Right. Right. Um, that's so funny. That's why <laughs> we have a lot of stuff coming up from your life. This. It's a very. My past this is things like, I even forgot. I know. Yeah. <laughs> um, let's go to Betsy from Arizona. Last call of the night for Terrence Howard. What's your question, Betsy? Um. Hi, Andy. Um. I just wanted to ask Terrence how happy he is. That he and that Cookie and Lucius are back to being married this season. Um, and can you tell us anything? That's what was wrong. And can you tell us anything about um, it was the storyline that Jesse Smollett says is groundbreaking and has never been done on television? Well, I I could give that away, but I would lose my job. Okay, we don't want but that. But the storyline with Cookie and with Lucius and the entire family. You know, the main point is to try and bring us back to reality. You know, for so long we've been billions of dollars to lose everything and have to start everything over again from the start. That's what most people experience in their lives. They don't have everything always work out. Murphy's Law seems to be the biggest law in people's lives. So I think that's what's going on in this this year and us working together as a family. I'm excited for it. I'm excited. Um, why did you want to have a, a brick and mortar Welco store? Oh, well, I think it's really important that our customer has some sort of interaction uh, with people uh, that can teach them about nutrition. And, uh, you know, we have a very good relationship with our customers. We are an online business, and we are a business that really um, works because our customers uh, speak to each other. Yeah. And, uh, but, you know, with any business, it's really important to have that kind of personal connection. Has this always been your passion? Uh, wellness is always, yeah. well, not always. I think fitness for the longest time was right. my passion. We and, saw uh, the, the... As uh, you saw the, earlier yeah. on. Yes. And as I matured, I realized I couldn't rely on my genetic predisposition any longer. Right. And I had to find some sort of solution to feel the best I possibly could. And so I started really going on a wellness journey. And then I wanted to share it with other women. And... And here we are. I can't believe that we're, you know, in New York City and opening a store. And many people are so excited about their own wellness. Yeah. You know, so it's very great. cool. Congratulations. I want to give it up to Elle and Terrence. And sorry, you. For more, click around ballotv.com. Good night, everybody. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here.
and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.